I'm sure this is my ring light. Oh my gosh. They pack, pack this really well. So I'm gonna unpack this, you guys, and then come back. <laughs> So it came with this light and I'm sure this is just a ring light and this is the post but I mean we're gonna see what's in here so let's open it up my prediction was right so here is it came in this box this is the post as you guys can see this is from China just like everything else I got this ring light off Amazon for 170 it's an LED ring light. And today we're going to be comparing is the bulb ring light or the LED ring light is better. And I'm going to compare if this ring light is actually different from the ring light that I have upstairs. This is LED. So, see the LED lights. So, what do we have in this box? Okay, so I see the little mirror. That's right. So you guys, it was a sticker. <laughs> I was able to get it off. Okay, so it comes with these two diffuser panels. And this one like a frost white color. And then so it also come with this um like orange light diffuse panel. And it's for like a warm light effect. Which I would think, I think I'm actually going to like that. Um, cell phone holder. And that's it. So, oh, I got a little screwdriver on here. Let's set this baby up, you guys. I'm going to set it up. And then I'm going to let you guys see the difference between the two. And, um, yeah, let's get to it. Hey you guys and welcome to Julia Vlogs. So today I'm comparing an LED ring light to a, a regular old ring light, which is a bulb ring light. So anyways, why do you want a ring light? Cause they make your YouTube video look cool, even though this video look cool and I'm not even using a ring light. <laughs> oh, <laughs> so, like I'm just playing. <laughs> it's like it does look cool though. There's no natural light, natural. So I look like a temptation when I did this. Yeah, it definitely looks like the temptation. My girl, my girl. So, <laughs> all right, so this is all natural light. And as you can see, it's just dimmed a little, so whatever. Um, So the reason why you want a ring light is like the thing to have if you're a YouTuber. Not only that, um, it's easy to set up compared to other lights like softbot lights or any other lights like the umbrella lights and things like that. So it's just easier to set up, um, as well as it's also a tripod, pretty much. It's also a tripod as well. Um, and if for those people that love to do overhead videos, it's an overhead video mount as well, you guys. So ring lights are in, like, how can I get all three of those in one? Get a ring light. You want a ring light. So yeah, I'm doing this video today on ring lights, but mainly I'm doing this to compare a regular ring light, which is a bulb ring light, compared to an LED ring light. So we're gonna look at the different lightnings. We're gonna look at the brands. I have, I'm comparing Flashpoint brands to this brand I found off Amazon, which is called Jensen right here. And we're gonna, we're gonna get into Jensen. Because you would think if you spend more money for something, it would be a better quality. But we want to get into that later, Jensen. 
So sit back, enjoy the ride, and watch this video and watch whether you should do LED ring light or you should just do a regular ring light with a bulb. So let's get into it. <laughs> Old ring light, meet new ring light. They kind of like having a standoff like one step probably. <laughs> okay, so pretty much I'm going to compare the LED ring light with just the Jensen ring light. And I paid about 170 bucks for this ring light. And that is old ring light in the back. Which I still love you old ring light. You're not going anywhere. <laughs> old ring light been holding me down. So this is new ring light. And which is a Jensen, which is the Jensen ring light. And it comes with these light panels which is cool and it also comes with the orange ones that i have right here which can give you like the warm light appearance which i really like that because um the brightness of this light can really take away from my complexion and i don't like that and a lot of times i try to add the complexion back into my skin in some of my videos so it does have a dimmer it does have a dimmer right here which is pretty cool However, it, it just still take away from my skin complexion and it, sometimes I just look pale and I try to add the color back into my skin on some of my videos, which is probably my reason that I'm still learning and I'm also learning how to, you know, work with the lightning and the camera lightning. I'm still learning my camera and I'm still learning lightning. So I like these because it might tone it down for me a little, which I'm going to get me some of these <laughs> oh because I'm taking this back <laughs> I'm gonna tell you why so um pretty much the cool aspects about this ring light is that okay so it does come with this little cool mirror right here which is cool that's cool right but when you think about it if you want to record and use this mirror like if you're doing makeup tutorials you can't use the mirror and your camera at the same time the camera will definitely be blocked off with the mirror now if you want to just take this off like some girls when they record the um, makeup tutorials you just take this ring light off um, use use it as a vanity and for just the lightning and maybe they can use the mirror and you could just put your camera on a tripod I guess you could do it that way but I'm a little blind so I would have to be up on the mirror and my camera will probably have to be behind <laughs> Unless I get some contact lens, but usually you all up in the mirror when you, you're doing a makeup tutorial. Like, you're pretty much into the mirror. And so, most likely this will have to be behind it. And it still doesn't look like it's that tall to actually put your camera in, behind the light. I don't know. It's, there is a way and there is a how. So, the way that I find out that you can use this and this at the same time is that you could buy a flexible metal tube, which I'm gonna put the link in the description box. You could buy the, um, it's like an extender pretty much, and you just screw it on here and it gives you hype, and maybe you could just use it that way. That's the only way I can see you using the mirror, the light, and your camera at the same time is get the extender. Um, so that's some cool aspects. The second thing is that it is an LED light, which is cool if it matters to you. Um, I'm gonna compare the lightning between the two, between the um, LED light as well as, you know, the bulb. So the LED light is cool. I like that. Um, however, when your lights burn out, you definitely have to replace the whole ring light. So that's the con about it. And, yeah, I mean, there's, there's a dimmer to it. That's nice. I mean, that's cool, that's cool. So now I'm gonna tell you a little bit about this company. This was pretty expensive. It's 18 inches um, around. And it didn't come with any instructions, you guys. So pretty much if you're not an expert in putting a ring light together, you may have to watch a YouTube tutorial on how to put a ring light together. 
because this company does not give you any instructions on how to put this together but it does come with the, a phone mount which was pretty good like Wolverine like did not come with a phone mount but since I had this mini tripod it already came with a phone mount so I really didn't need a phone mount but ring, new ring light which is Jensen ring light company does come with a phone mount so that's a pro now I don't know how much like time hours you would get out of this this ring light because literally like once the lights burn out you cannot replace the light you just simply have to buy a new ring light as you guys can say if you have a handy boyfriend he probably can fix it put it back to find another one for you guys I don't know maybe you can ask the company for another one but it's definitely not sold on Amazon as whereas old ring light you can definitely replace and it is sold on Amazon. So that's new ring light. Now let's look at old ring light. This is old ring light. And old ring light has been really good to me. This And this is by Flashpoint. This is a 17 inch ring light. And it came with this cover. It's similar to a soft box cover. Which is not panels, but it's like a cloth. cloth. And with old ring light, you can replace the book and it's sold on Amazon. Now how easy it is, it looks a bit easier. It looks like you would just unscrew these and remove the plastic, replace the bulb and you know, just snap it together. But you have this cord that you can just snap a new bulb in. That's look pretty easy for me to do myself. I'm sure I can do that because <laughs> got a little handy skills. Now, with old ring light, even though it didn't come with the mirror and it didn't come with these light panels, they can actually still go on old ring light. So, as you guys can see, this is where, where the mirror will go. Right here, you screw the mirrors onto it and snap these panels just on. Yeah, you guys, for some reason, these light panels fit better on this ring light, which is a 17 inch, and it fits on the 18 inch. So, it doesn't, this was 109 bucks. I got it off Amazon, we'll put the link. I did buy it a while ago, I don't know if the price changed, but I bought this off Amazon a while ago. It didn't come with the mirror, it didn't come with the lighting panel, but it definitely just came with this. That's it, and it came with the ring light and you know, the tripod. As well as old ring light is definitely a dimmer as well. So they both are dimmers. The only difference is that this is above and it's 17 inches and it's two different companies. But and it didn't come with the panel lights and the mirror, but you can buy these accessories off of Amazon. Now, I didn't know that, and I actually bought a whole new ring light, which is an LED ring light. And I'm gonna tell you why it suck a little, but we about, we about to get to it. It suck. And it's from China. This is Flashpoint, I'm not sure if it's made in China, but the quality of it seems a little better to me. Um. It seems better. Now, if I wanted to record overhead video and I wanted to use this as a tripod overhead mount, it's really, really not that sturdy, you guys. Look at it. Now, I'm, I might want it to be right here. Now, I'm gonna tighten it up as tight as I can. It's just not that sturdy. It's not made that well to function as overhead mount. And this as tight as I can get the 
adjustable to go to no it's just not working as it's just not a good tripod mount to use to record overhead videos I wouldn't go with this brand you might find another company I know newer is a good company to get good um, ring lights so you may can find this at newer and the plus is cheaper it does come with the panels but it doesn't come with the mirror and I mean you can buy the mirror separately Now, old ring light, which is Flashpoint, does actually works really good as the overhead tripod. I hope uh, I always mix these two together. <laughs> it's actually this one right here. And I didn't have to put all this might into tightening it up. It still can be tightened up more, and guess what? It's not flimsy. It's very sturdy. And it's just a better model, you guys. And this, this was only 109 bucks, and that one was 170 And this is way better. And like I said, it doesn't come with the accessories, but you guys can definitely purchase the accessories separately. So I don't think it matters. Um and you might find them cheaper and it still may come off cheaper as what I paid for a tire ring light. And I don't see a function with the mirror so I wouldn't even use the mirror literally. Like you honestly you don't even need the mirror. You might as well just um, use a mini vanity to just record your videos instead of using that mirror. The mirror is plastic, it's not real glass. It's a plastic mirror, which is kind of good. So we'll break that easily. But if you want that feature, just buy it separately. You guys can definitely t test out the newer, um, the newer ring light. It may work just better with that ring light. However, I did find it to be cheaper than the Jensen ring light, as well as I heard better reviews. I just find it to be better to go with the one with the bug because literally you want to have a tripod, but once your ring light burns out with the LED ring light, it's done. You have to buy a tire ring light because they don't they don't have replacements. But even if you just got a head, it's still costly. So then just the the bug itself. Um, so I will just go with old ring light, which is above and not LED and the flash point and not Jensen because I find Jensen to not be that sturdy when you want to use it as a overhead tripod and it's just, it's horrible. Okay, you guys, so this is old ring light and I'm going to turn it up for you guys a little. I turned the dimmer up. And this at its full maximum. Um, yeah, so this is old ring light. Now let's just look at the light. Now you can see that when I use the ring light, it put the light focus on me and kind of dim out the background. Okay, so this is the LED ring light. Um, hmm. I don't know. It does look a little different. What you think, guys? That said, it's maximum light. Oh, that's really bright. So this is that medium down low.
really low. Back up to somewhat low, medium, maximum. It definitely seemed a little brighter, but it's like, like it's bright that it's hurting my eyes. I'll let you guys be the judges of which one you like better from the lightning. That's the lightning for you guys. You can judge it yourself. Um, like I said, I told you the pros and the cons of both rain lights. I'm not being biased. I This is not sponsored, <laughs> you know, like I paid my money for both of these. I, I'm definitely taking this one back because it's, it's a little flimsy. But you guys, like I said, subscribe to my channel. I love you guys. try to look somewhat presentable for you guys as you can see I did not wake up like this I added a little makeup to the wake up so at least give me a thumbs up if you don't subscribe because I'm not even gonna ask for any subscriptions today because I look like this today so <laughs> please give me a thumbs up though because it did take hard work LED, bub, LED. Yo, my ears was looking big, super big, wasn't it, y'all? My ears was looking big like bumbo. Take off with these bad boys. 